Some of the birds I only see it once or twice in all my life of photographer, so you need a lot of luck to get them. Some birds only stay here one day, two days per year. This is like a, a, a green oasis in the middle of the city. Birds tend to get here. One day I was photographing Macau, and I start noticing some birds going from point A to point B or point C, and I start photographing them, and I enjoy it. I took two of my pleasures, nature and photography, together. The focus is to get as most species that I can. My primary goal is the photography, is getting the bird in a posing position, in a good position. The light, the, the background. For the bird watcher, that's almost irrelevant. The only thing he wants is to see the bird. I usually wake up at 6.30 to start looking to see if I can find those rare birds. I started birding since I was a kid. My father would talk me out and he would introduce me what are those birds are, even though there was not a lot of species. And then later on, I became a bird lover. In Macau, we got a lot of bird photographers, but with binoculars, you can see things faster than the cameras. I think in 100, only five people in Macau, they have binoculars. Usually people, they just use cameras. It's a little bit competitive. Everybody wants to be the first one to take that first bird. We have a WeChat group. People start saying, hey, there's a new bird here, so on, and the community congregate around the, the, the WeChat. In April and September, the migrating seasons, I usually go birding alone. I almost dedicate the whole month to go birding and see whatever I can find in the wild. The fortress, which is in the middle of the city, it provides a little bit of everything for birds to eat, so it attracts them to come here to stay a while. Some birds, I only, I only get it here. Birds that uh, eat seeds and plants. And sometimes we see eagles and falcons and stuff like that. One of my favorite is called the Caesar's Firecatcher, and it only visits during spring times. The first thing to enjoy bird watching is just go out to have a walk. Just don't get too close, enjoy it for a distance, and wait for it to come. Don't chase the birds. The birds will see you way before you can see them. So the best tip for that is to choose a place, stay, and wait. The second tip is be persistent. When I go birding, I feel myself being connected to nature. I think the most important lesson is that no matter what the men do, no matter how much buildings we'll build, the nature will persist.